Hey guys, David Hazard here from Hazard's Gaming. Welcome back to Surgeon Simulator. Today, if you guys did not know, is the day that the Carolina Reapers video goes live. So, you guys, by the time this is posted, that'll already be out. So, guys, go check that out. It's going to be really funny for you guys to watch. It's um, me and a few of my friends um, going to eat the world's hottest pepper, the Carolina Reaper. Um, it was very painful, and it's been a while um, since it's happened. It was like a week or two. And I've been waiting to post this video. It was just, um, I was trying to collect all the um, footage and everything and put it all together. And it's up today. So if you guys are watching this go and haven't seen it yet, go check it out. Link will be in the description below so you guys can just check it out there. So let's get right into this baby. I've played this game before. If you guys have not seen me play it, it's really hard. I'm playing on PlayStation right now. And you use the motion sensors in the controller to control your hand. R1 is to do this, L2 is to do that, and if you put them both together, you can do this. Use the analog stick to move your hand around, and that's about it. And then L2 to lower yourself. Um, that's about it for the controls for this game, and let's go into operations. I've complete every, completed every single operation in this game. Um, it can get to be very difficult. So, what I decided to do is I, I think last time I did a heart transplant, in an eye. What I'm going to do this time is a kidney and a brain. The kidney is probably the hardest one for me. Let's see. Let's check my grades. B, D, B, A, A. This is definitely my worst surgery. I'm hoping to get a better score on this, but this is definitely the hardest surgery there is. Let's get right into this baby. I'm really in a good mood today, and I hope you guys are too. It is Tuesday. I know the week's been going by kind of slow already. It's off to a slow start, but hey, you know, it can speed up. So, first off, I'm going to break these um, ribs here so we don't have a time limit. As you can see up in the top left, that's just timing how long we're doing this. So, what I want to do is I want to take these ribs out first, and then we'll, um, we'll take out the liver and then we'll cut out the stomach all right and then maybe cut a few intestines we'll probably cut near the um near the rectum down there and then pull out the intestines all right yes i actually know something and for those of you that laughed when i said rectum because i can't hear you but i know some of you are grab the hell up okay i gotta laugh a little too okay Oh, God. Okay. Got some broken ribs. It's really hard to hammer ribs in. Okay. Okay, we're good. Don't need that anymore, Doc. All right. Now let's pull out some of these ribs. Oh, I should break that rib. I knew I'd need it. I threw it. Okay, that cut that bone. Okay. Doctor, we're losing him! It's okay. We're gonna be okay. Stab him in the face. All right. His blood has stabilized. Now let's try to remove some of these um, ribs. Oh, we got the liver. It, it got rid of, okay, there it goes. We don't need that liver even though that's not even what we're replacing. So, scalpels are over to the right here. We're going to start the incision over by the stomach. So. That was not the stomach I know. Okay, I think we got it. Yep, now I just got to get this freaking thing out of here. Okay. I'm trying to cut. Oh, I don't cut near the rectum. I guess I cut both sides of the... Okay, I got one side of the large intestine. We're losing him quickly. Drop the syringe and grab the scalp. I <laughs> drop the scalpel and grab the syringe. Oh no, I'm high. I'm a doctor and I'm high. On my own supply. That's rule number one. Never. Oh god, we're gonna lose him because his freaking head is so big. Where's the other syringe? Okay, I can inject myself to actually try and straighten myself up a little. Where'd it go? Okay. 
Now hopefully I can just inject myself here. There we are. We're nice and clean, but we're losing him fast. No! Okay. He's stabilized on his own, which is weird. That doesn't usually happen. But I'm not going to complain. I'm just going to try and get to work here. Now, we're not going to... He's not going to survive, but we can try. Now, the only... Okay, I got the large intestine out. It's good. So, let's pull this baby out. Don't eat it. Large intestine, there you go. Now, on to the small. Now, I think I'm going to cut near the bottom of the stomach. And I think we've already got the rectum cut. So, I think we just cut this baby. Yep, because we got an incision there, right there, already. Now, all I need to do is cut near the stomach, and then we can take this baby. Maybe we could do this. It'll be very difficult, but I'm a good doctor. My patients don't say so, but I know it. I know it deep down that they care. There we go. It's done. All right, there goes the small intestine, a part of the small intestine. There goes the second part of the small intestine. His kidneys are right there. Let's get the stomach out of here. G get out of here, stomach. Okay, now if you see those wires there, um, they're like blood vessels or whatever. Um, they're not, I don't think they're really colored that color, but like the wires, but I think it's just so that you can actually see them. Now, we have to cut those. I'm going to drop that because I did not get a good grip. You do have to get a good grip on these things. Um, okay. We're going to take a nice incision over. You want to get it right where it enters the kidney. Got it. One down, one to go. I think I got both. I think we're good, guys. We're in the clear. Now, getting the kidneys out is very hard. It's probably one of the hardest parts of the surgery along with trying to get this all done in a timely manner. I do not think I actually got that. So, we're gonna try and hurry this up and get this done. Get out of here, I don't need my watch. I'm a doctor for God's sakes, I don't need a watch. Unless it's like time of death. Okay, kidney's out. Get the kidney. No, we need the kidney out. Get, okay, kidneys out. Where's where's our replacement kidneys? Here's one. They look like kidney beans. That's why they're called kidney beans, people. I'll just push them up after. Hopefully I can get these done in time. Whew. Oh, no, that's not where that goes. I think one, that one kidney's in place. Close enough, I think you only have to get close. So now I'm gonna grab like a pencil or something so I don't stab him and just inch that baby up. No, no, go up. We're losing him, come on! Come on. Boom, baby! I still got a D, but I completed it. I'm so proud, guys. I'm gonna go tell my mom. All right, one more surgery to go, guys. So far, we're one and oh. Okay, so that baby is done. Now, brain surgery. On we go. I'm 99% sure we did, um, I um, surgery last time so now what we're gonna start with is it's gonna seem very unorthodox what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this hatchet right here and we are gonna smash his skull until it is nothing we will destroy his in as much of his skull as we can and we are gonna rip his brain out and pop it out of the skull and then cut the cord and place the new one in. So, let's get this baby started. I'm just gonna start by smash. Ah, it's stuck in his head. Now, as you can see, it's starting to pull his...
body and his skull apart, but he's, he begins to lose blood very fast. So we've got to be ready at all times to grab this um, syringe and stab him with it. See, now he's good. Now, I'd like to clear this table here. I, I don't like that drill. It gets in the way and it's, I don't use it. I think some people actually do use the drill though. I use the, um, the other drill, like the bone drill or whatever. Ram! Guts, glory, ram. Oh, that's his eye. That's not gonna feel good in the morning. Oh no, he's dead! I think it's like, I think his brain's very sensitive. So now we are one in one. Brutal murdered achieved in a mere one minute and 30 seconds. That's actually a new record for me. I've never killed somebody that fast. So, there we go. All right, I think I'm gonna use the hammer instead this time. It's a little um, weaker. It doesn't do, you know, and it you can aim a little bit better with it, not a lot. but I feel like it won't cut as much as just smash. And they don't call me David Smash for nothing. They don't call me that, actually. Just so you guys know, they don't call me David Smash. I wish they did. That would make me seem like even more of a badass than I already am. Yes, I'm a badass. Even for those of you that know me. <laughs> okay. I almost broke that. That would have been a problem. All right, he's starting to lose blood very fast. Stab him! Where do you want me to stab him, Doc? Right in the eye! Okay, he needs to be stabbed again. He was still losing blood. In a slow manner, but we couldn't take that. Now, I want to see if I can... It's, he's at the point where I can pull it out yet. No, I need to break that piece right there. So, I'm gonna go to Old Faithful. That, oh my! Oh my god, he's gonna die again! My god, I'm not good at this. I'm telling you, it's that freaking hatchet. It takes his whole freaking life. Okay, the brain's out. I know that seemed really freaking laggy and weird, but. No! Okay. If we stab him with this, we should be good. Oh, whoops, I put it inside of his head. Stab him. Okay, let's get this brain in him, people! It's gonna be alright, buddy. No! We need the brain! Well, it's a loss again. Retry! And we got plenty of time to kill, so. All right, guys, just so you do know, I'm actually um, generating the, I'm sending the video. I thought I was generating, but no, I'm uploading the video to YouTube now, and it's at 84%, but since I'm not doing this from a computer or anything, um, but from my actual phone itself, because when I, I had to do a lot of weird work to do this, it was... Like, because we didn't film it with a camera, we filmed it with a phone, and I tr um, I didn't film it on mine, so well, we had to do a lot of people sending it to me, trying to get this freaking hammer. So it was, it was a struggle. And now it's finally done, but it ended up taking a lot. I couldn't use any of my things on the computer because the file wouldn't open, so I said, you know what, let's just do it, you know, the cheapest way possible and use your phone. So that's what I did. Okay. By the way, I will never use that hatchet again. Ram! See, look at this. I've straight up obliterated, obliterated his entire skull, and he's still at 4,000 health. See, when I had this much done with the hatchet, I had like 1,000 health, if that. Okay, he's good. We need to give him a, a um, syringe. I mean, yeah, that was right. I'm telling you, it's sad. Because I don't like it. 
All right, let's see if we can pull this baby out yet. No, I see what we need to do. What about now? There we go. We're still at 3,000. Gotta cut that. Right underneath the medulla. And if you guys don't know what the medulla is, if you guys look at this brain here, it's that little part underneath. Like, it looks like a whole separate separate part. Like, the brain all looks like one besides the medulla. There we go. There's the old brain. Actually, if I can grab that quick. Okay, I'll, I'll show you guys in the other one, just in case you couldn't see it. But I should inject him just so we're safe. And you are there. Don't need that baby anymore unless I got drug done it wasn't bad. I'm trying to put a brain in the drug. Does not work well. Okay. I'm gonna pull this baby out of here. Now, you see that part that kinda looks very inappropriate? The two ball-like shaped things? That's the medulla. Now I'm gonna try and drop this ba brain and spin it around. The medulla is supposed to be on the other side. No, not again. Take four. I'm telling you, I keep dropping this brain and it's not ending up there. Please do not drop it again. Ah, oh, get it out of there. Okay, let's spin this we got this baby up over here. Inject him with that pack. You don't need it. I don't need it. Just turn. You stupid little. There we go. No, no, no. We have it. There you are. I got this baby in. That's not right. That is not right. The medulla is supposed to be... Oh, there we go. It considered it a D. <laughs> looks to me. Uh, looks fine to me. I'm sure he'll live. All right. Well, that was actually quite painful, if I may say so myself. So, that's really it for today. I've posted two videos, and again, if you guys did not remember or you guys didn't watch the beginning of the video and you just zoomed I, I fast forwarded right towards the end um, I did post my video on where a few friends and I um, ate some Carolina Reapers the hottest pepper in the world um, I ate five and they ate they all ate one it was extremely painful and that is was posted right before this so if you guys could go and check that out that would be great um, it is my previous video. It is in the description below. So that's really all I have to say, guys. Thank you guys all for watching. Please like, subscribe, and or comment. And I'll see you guys later. See ya.